$10,000 is a whole lot of money for anyone, but especially for a homeless person. And this guy found a $10,000 check, but decided to do the right thing with it. News H Renee Schmiel joins us live now with why he says he did it. Renee. Elmer Alvarez found an envelope on the ground with the check inside, and a friend helped him call the phone number on it, and that's how he tracked down the check's owner. Imagine Elmer Alvarez's surprise when he found a check for more than $10,000 near the corner of Temple and Chapel Streets in downtown New Haven. But he wasn't thinking of himself or what he could do with that money. I was just thinking about how that person was feeling. You know, by losing an amount of check like that, you know, an amount of money like that, uh, I would be feeling kind of desperate. That person was Roberta Husky. She didn't realize she'd lost the check until she got a phone call from Alvarez and his friend. Service to others is the rent we pay to live on Earth. That is true. Husky then went on Facebook Live, recording her meeting with Alvarez, and when she got the check back. He had no idea who the person was behind the check. He didn't know that I was a single mother. I was on, I at one point was on welfare, at one point found myself homeless. Alvarez says giving the check back and seeing Husky's reaction was even better than $10,000, and he'd do it all over again. Seeing her happy, you know, seeing her appreciating it and all that, you know, made me feel good. Oski is now trying to say thank you. She wrote him a check and is helping him get an education and an apartment of his own. There need to be more people like Elmer Alvarez. He's a he's a golden heart guy. He's a he's a phenomenal guy. I appreciate everything she's doing for me right now. Husky says she hopes one day Alvarez will pay it forward and help somebody else who's struggling with homelessness. Live in the newsroom, Renee Schmiel, News 8. All right, Renee, thanks. News 8 teaming up with the Connecticut Food Bank for a food drive. It is the WTNH forecast to end hunger happening November 18th from 11 in the morning until 1 in the afternoon at ShopRite in East Haven. The guys will be out there accepting frozen turkeys and non-perishable food items for the holiday.